everyone welcome to today's video today we are just gonna do a little day in my life but i really wanted to talk about some healthy habits for the summertime summer is like one of the best times to start new healthy habits and just really focus on self-care and being healthy and doing things to just better yourself i'm just getting ready to go to the gym and i'm doing my ice roller honestly this is like such a good self-care habit one of the other healthy habits that i've been really really working on lately is getting at least seven to nine hours of sleep to be honest i feel like i feel the best when i get like eight to nine hours of sleep i've been really trying to set a rule for myself that i have to be in bed like off my phone by 11 and then i would wake up at around seven that's around eight hours of sleep one thing that i found is when i'm lacking energy i just don't do any of my other healthy habits i really want to have energy throughout my day that's one of my main like motivations so now i'm going to the gym which is another really good healthy habit is just move your body at the gym lately i've been listening to a podcast it's like a two-in-one i feel like i'm like learning something but i'm also getting stronger and doing something good for my body i think i'm gonna listen to this podcast they have some good like advice about social media and content creation and stuff so i think i'm gonna listen to that i'm also gonna eat a protein bar because i feel like eating enough protein is one of my habits that i really want to improve on <laughs> back and biceps like i said i am gonna do my morning skincare and i've been changing it up a bit recently i really want to promote healthy skin for the summer and my skin be super hydrated first i use the cerave hydrating cream to foam cleanser i've used this for a while and i really like it so i'm gonna do that after i do that you want your skin to still be slightly damp. Then I do a hyaluronic acid. Right now I'm using this Bondi Sands one because I just have it, but I really do like the Good Molecules one a lot. I like to go down to my neck. I've been trying to get a lot better about doing skincare on my neck because I have been so bad about it and I know that your neck is just as important as your face for skincare. So I've been trying to get better then a new thing that i've been doing is i've heard people say to let everything like dry and stuff if you feel like oh my gosh if you feel like your moisturizer like when you put it on it what are you doing if you feel like when you put your moisturizer on it burns your skin you're supposed to let like everything dry on your face before putting moisturizer on and i have very sensitive dry skin so i definitely feel like when i put my moisturizer on when my face is still wet it burns a little bit especially like in this area because i do get like some redness let this dry a little bit and then i use the cerave facial moisturizing lotion this one has spf 30 in it which is one of my really important habits for the summer is putting spf on because it's extremely important in the summer to hydrate your skin and protect it from the sun so that's what i do and i do it on my neck too i read that like sun damage is like the number one cause of like damage to your skin and like aging and all of that and it's really good to start young and like protect your skin from the sun i think it was like 80 percent of like aging is caused by sun damage so that's my morning skincare pretty simple and it's a nice base for my makeup okay now i'm gonna make some breakfast one of my biggest tips for eating healthy and eating more protein because that's one of my goals is to have one like sweet breakfast option that's healthy and has a lot of protein and nutrients and stuff in it and then also have a savory option i feel like sometimes i'll have only like a sweet option and then 
if I'm feeling like eating something savory, I'll either just like settle and eat the sweet option or I'll just end up eating something unhealthy just to like have like the savory taste or the sweet taste. Today, I think I'm feeling sweet for breakfast, so I'm gonna have a parfait. This is the brand of yogurt that I really like. I really like Chobani. This has 14 grams of protein in like three fourths of a cup, which is not that much yogurt. And it's very filling, it's super yummy. It's like such a good breakfast. Definitely would recommend the vanilla Greek yogurt because if you don't like like the sourness of Greek yogurt, the vanilla isn't really that sour. And then I just top it with some fruit and my favorite granola. It's the Purely Elizabeth. And then I like to add some almonds on top. bowl it just has so many yummy things in it this is Junie's new toy she's loving it Justin made me a matcha he's been making me my matchas lately and trying to like get good at making them and He's been doing a really good job. I figured I'd do a little bit of my summer makeup routine. I've kind of changed it up a little bit. Started doing my makeup a little bit differently for summer, like very subtle, subtle differences. I use this Maybelline Dream Fresh BB Cream. This I just like because it has SPF in it and it's pretty light coverage. And then I blend it with this brush. This one's from Merit. I feel like lately I've been doing a lot of things, like I said before, for my future self that like I'll just be really happy that I've been doing all along. I feel like these habits aren't obviously just for the summer. They're also for your future self and just feeling really good. It just makes me much more motivated to work on the habits and consistently do them. My battery just died so I'm back now. Then I use this Rare Beauty bronzer stick in the shade Power Boost. I love these bronzer sticks. I think I kind of want to go a little bit darker next time. I get a new one because I do feel like the shade is good for me but in the summer I when I'm like tanner I just feel like this isn't enough of like a bronzing effect I guess and this is more of like a warm tone and I feel like I have more cool toned skin I think it's also because my freckles I've been just trying to improve and just really get 1% better every day I've also been doing a lot with money management and research on how to invest and how to make passive income and just how to set myself up for success so i'm really excited about all that recently and once i learn more about it i'll definitely make a video on it if that's something you guys want to see next i use the bahama mama bronzer this is so old it's probably so bad for me to be using this but i don't use it too too often this is from the balm cosmetics i don't even know if like this exists anymore this used to be like the most popular bronzer you know in the original youtube era and i kind of just like to like add a little bit of bronzer around my face just to warm it up a little bit for the summertime but i also like studying my cream products with powder products now because i feel like when i had so many cream products on my face it was making it almost feel very cakey and this is just nice and light so next i use the merit flush balm in the shade beverly hills i always get questions on my blush and i am just obsessed with this blush in general merit is just literally the best makeup it's just all natural and it just makes me feel so good and it doesn't irritate my skin at all they've just like up leveled my makeup routine so much so i just always recommend them and the one thing i've been doing a bit differently which I kind of messed up just now is I've been trying to only put the blush like here and up it kind of creates more of like a lift of your cheek and of your face it just looks nice for the summertime I always put some on my nose as well and then you guessed it we're gonna set it with a powder product and I just use this NYX sweet cheeks in the shade summer breeze which is perfect for summer it kind of matches the merit shade pretty well so I like doing that just to give a little bit more of a sun-kissed look. Then another favorite from Merit is their highlighting balm. I use the shade Kava, but I really like these highlighting balms. I feel like a creamy highlight always looks really nice. One thing a lot of people don't talk about in like healthy habits videos 
is healthy money habits for the summer. Also, I'm taking this NYX finishing powder. This is just like their um, translucent powder. And then I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal Lash Paradise mascara, which is my holy grail mascara. Anyway, I feel like money habits, they're just something a lot of people don't talk about. I'm trying to be wary about where my money is going. I love buying like bikinis and clothes. And to me, that stuff is very worth it. I just have to make sure that like, it's things I'm gonna use all the time and think about a purchase for a bit before I actually make it. That is a big way to just have a hot girl summer and glow up and improve your life like inside and out is getting better with money and money habits. Cause healthy girl summer and hot girl summer doesn't just mean like physical health even only just mental health i feel like it can mean like emotional and financial health all of that i'm honestly almost out of this as you can see it's like all around the side it's like almost gone so i might get the other shades i have but this is the merit beauty shade stick it's just like a tinted lip oil this is like my completed summer makeup look i can do a more in-depth makeup tutorial at some point for the summer i've been very into watching like makeup routines and skincare routines lately so if you're interested in that definitely let me know i really want to show you guys some of the new stuff that i got for the summertime we went to tj maxx and i also ordered a couple things on amazon so i figured i'd give you a little bit of a haul of everything at tj maxx the first thing that i got is this little planner look how freaking cute this is i needed a notebook for content planning and i needed a notebook for taking notes on money management and getting better with money because that's one of my goals for the rest of the year. I really wanted to have a notebook that was cute, that inspired me to take those notes out. I think this notebook, as much as I really want to use it for content planning, I might make this one my money planning notebook just because I feel like I'm going to be taking a lot of notes on videos and podcasts and things. And I love like notebooks like this that you can fold the page over. Then I also picked up these two notebooks before I found that one. These ones I can actually link for you guys. These are just giving Polly Pocket in my opinion and I'm here for it. So this is like the pink one and then this is the blue one. I got these new pillows for the couch which I really love because I felt like it was just very basic and all white and now I feel like it kind of goes with the shelf above it. You guys can't really see it that well because my camera doesn't like zoom out that far. We also just picked up this candle for the summer because it just smells so good. Plus it's called ocean mist and amber which i love because my name is amber so anyway love that and then <laughs> we picked up justin's laughing at me we also picked up this little basket for junie because her toys are like everywhere and we have never had a spot to put them and i actually think it goes really well with this like our tv stand I just think it looks nice with it. This was at TJ Maxx and it was only like $5 or something like that, but it works really well. And she has a couple of her toys in it, but the rest of them are kind of scattered around. She's like watching me right now. Hi, Boogie. What are you doing? Oh, see, she uses it. She sometimes gets in it. Oh, she's putting herself to bed. So tired. We also picked up at TJ Maxx a different time that we went. Actually, these are from Home Goods, I think, but I'm pretty sure Home Goods and TJ Maxx are basically the same thing. But we got these little towels and they're really cute for the summertime. I feel like these could go for spring or summer, but I actually really like this kind of dish towel because these like absorb so much more than those like regular dish towels. So I definitely recommend these. And you can also use them as bathroom towels. Right now we have in our bathroom right now, we have these ones, which are dish towels. I love just like picking up new like decor for a new season. I just feel like it makes me feel so much more fresh and I don't know, it makes me feel good. We also got her some new decor and she's been really enjoying it. That's everything that we picked up at the store. I think that I'm gonna end this video here. Those are all of my really big summer non-negotiables. And also these healthy habits aren't unique to summer. Like you could do these all year round, but I feel like summer's such a good time to focus on some of these habits, especially like hydrating and hydrating your skin and stuff like that, SPF. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Definitely let me know if you want me to make more videos like this, like more healthy habits or anything like that. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Definitely let me know down below and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll see you all in my next video.